Ugh, I don't like this angle. There we go. Hello. So, I'm very excited. I'm about to start a jean jacket. Ah! I'm so excited. So I'm gonna let you guys know exactly what I'm gonna be using because I do get a lot of questions on that. Um, normally, I would prep it, my paintings with the gesso. Um, for this, I will just be using <laughs> the lighting. Um, this golden GAC 900 heat set fabric painting medium. And I will be mixing this with the Angelus acrylic leather paints. Um, I really like these. I used these on um, shoes before and they were really good. Um, but I will be starting with starting with these two as kind of like the just to prep the fabric. If you go in directly with just like the colors that you're going to use, they're not going to be as vibrant. So this is best. Start with white as your under layer and then go from there. Okay, <laughs> excuse my face. This week has been kind of tough. Um, having gotten a lot of sleep, as you can tell. And these masks are just killing my face with all this acne. <laughs> but that's the life of living now. But anyway, so I just did this. Um, I hate this part. Like prepping it is such a tedious yeah, I would say tedious. Just because, ugh, layers and layers and layers. Um, but, almost done with the under layer. So it doesn't have to be perfect, obviously. Um, so I'm just waiting for it to dry, and then I have to iron it. Oh, <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Anyway, so I just finished um, kind of prepping. I still, ugh, the lighting here is terrible. Anyways, um, so, ugh, hello light. <laughs> I still need to do because some of the flowers are gonna go. So I'm doing a sunflower, um, Vincent Van Gogh's, to be exact. And so some of them are gonna go out of this little like rectangle area. So I just need to prep that as well. I have paint all over me. Um, this is pretty cool. Um, I've tried other brands, but this one, I so far so good. Um, so I just need to wait for it to dry and then I have to um, heat press or I guess just iron, let me see. Yeah, heat set, so iron it for three to five minutes, so that shall be fun. Um, like I said, I just need to finish the little corners, not the corners, but like the little areas where the sunflowers are going to kind of like spill out of the little rectangle. And uh, I am so, uh, this lighting keeps changing, but... I am so excited, like, I hate setting up, like, just prepping the thing, whatever I'm gonna use, because I'm, like, so anxious to just start the project, <laughs> but yeah, God willing, it's probably gonna be one of my favorites, maybe. <sighs> Each piece has its own thing, so, I don't know, but I'm so excited. I swear, like, I was never the type to have, like, bite marks on my pencils or anything like that, but my paintbrushes is another story. Um, so here I am just kind of adding kind of like the, I am not left-handed whatsoever, but anyways, um, <laughs> just kind of adding uh, the little lines of where I want to keep adding on the sides um, so I can go ahead and mix up a little bit more of the paint with the medium but anywho I need coffee so I basically drink one of these like almost every day <sighs> still here <laughs> hours later um so i had to wait for this to to dry i guess with the medium it takes a lot longer maybe it just like slows down the process of um 
of the actual drying time because normally acrylic is not that long um, for it to dry but so I started kind of um, you can barely see it I can I just did kind of like the main lines just to I don't know how to do this um, just a quick sketch um, I had to do it with just like a regular pen a ballpoint pen um, because the pencil it was not showing up um, even though this is more free so I'm excited for like because Van Gogh's style is more you know way different from what I'm used to so here we go So here is the after. Um, the lighting in here is not the best, so it's a little bit more warm in real life. It looks a bit cool here. And thank you for watching. Um, here is the finished product. Um, it's a little bit more detailed than, not detailed, but I would say more outlined than the original or some that I've seen done, but. What can you do? I mean, <laughs> I am me. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I definitely did. I can't wait to to do another one in the future. Hope you like it, Sandy.